your life, your world, your news. This is 69 News Weekend Edition, live at 6. That's the sound of hail falling in Redding just a short time ago. We've had reports of quarter-size hail, and as you just saw there, that hail was the size bigger than a dime, actually. People all over the viewing area taking cover as a line of severe thunderstorms rumbles through, even resulting in a tornado warning for Berks County. And these storms are moving through our area right now. And they sure are. And with the latest on the storm, here's WFMZ meteorologist Amanda Cox. Amanda. And we are going to continue to keep watching this system. There is a severe thunderstorm warning. We're moving through the area. Most of this is being expanded. We have a, a tornado warning. This did expire at 6 p.m. It has not updated on the thing, but we will continue to see it expiring. There was a tornado reported, but it was indicated by the Doppler radar. We are going to have to continue to watch that and see if we get any more information in on it. We'll let you know what exactly happened. There is also quite a few severe thunderstorm warnings out for Chester, Montgomery, Bucks, Lehigh, and Northampton. This is until 645 this evening, and we will continue to keep you updated on that. We also have another severe thunderstorm warning for Carbon County, and this is until 615. This is because of a storm cell that is making its way through the area, and we will We'll continue to watch this, but Ed is in this, the storm center right now tracking this cell, and he will give you all the little details of how this system is tracking across the area. Let's head over to Ed. All right, thanks very much. Now, here's good to see everybody. It's, as far as the weekend is concerned, pretty quiet uh, until just about an hour or ago. We've got what we've got going on is pretty significant storm cell moving into our area. Now, I want to be able to show you behind me. You can see a pretty significant line that's moving through our area, and what we've got is right on through from Carbon County all the way down into Lehigh County, down now just brushing the, the Berks and Montgomery County line. Pretty significant. It's important to note, though, as we move through time here, what's happening is that significant cell that was over Berks County that caused the tornado warning, it's stretching out. And so now you're seeing more kind of like taffy stretched out. You're seeing more of a kind of a, a longer line rather than that one pretty significant cell over Berks County. What that means for us is much more more by way of straight line winds, certainly have the potential for damaging winds. In Berks County, we saw 54 mile an hour wind just about a half an hour ago, but hail like in Lee Heighton, one inch, Fleetwood, Shillington, Blandon within the last half hour, golf ball size hail, very strong winds, easily could see wind gusts exceeding 50 or 60 miles an hour or even stronger than that. Again, a funnel cloud had been reported southwest of Warnersville about a half hour, around 40, 40 minutes ago. And the good news, I think, is looking at this Doppler radar, it does appear that this is all stretching out. Still don't want to let our guard down. Want to encourage you to seek shelter here. If you happen to be in the Lehigh Valley area, again, with severe thunderstorms, you can have talk about very significant straight line winds. We're keeping a close eye on this. At this point, there's been no tornado reported. The Doppler radar indicated a signature that could have indicated there certainly was rotation with some of these thunderstorms. There was a funnel cloud reported, but as of this hour, as of right now, there's been no tornado touchdown. There's just been some significant winds, heavy downpours, and I think we're going to continue to talk about that here until this line passes through. Behind that, there's some showers around, and what's, as we watch this line, it looks like it may be moving into a bit more stable air. Although we have to watch it, we're going to give you the full six-day forecast. Again, don't go away if you're in the Lehigh Valley area. If you want to seek shelter, keep your TV and your radio nearby and watching that. And we're going to keep you posted here, giving you a full report in just a bit. Guys, back over to you. All right, Ed. We'll see you in just a few more.